This fall garland of acorns and leaves made out of pipe cleaners is inexpensive and easy to make. So let me show you how. For this project, you will need tan and dark brown pipe cleaners for the acorns, two or three different colors of pipe cleaners for the fall leaves, fingernail clippers, a thick marker, a pencil, scissors, and twine. To make the bottom part of the acorn, you're going to hold one of the tan pipe cleaners up against a pencil. Start spiraling it around the pencil and make one loop go right on top of the other for two loops and then do the same thing. Go around once and twice right on top of the other and a third time. With the rest of it, just spiral it down in single loops on the pencil, but keep them very close together. Remove the pencil and where you ended, twist those spirals even tighter. Take the very end and make that as tight as you can and then twist up two or three spirals so they're tighter. And this is making that end of the nut that's a little pointier. To make the top of the acorn, hold a dark brown pipe cleaner against a thick marker, spiral it around doing the same thing. The first two spirals right on top of the other and then do it a second time. Then you're going to go once around the marker, hold everything together and pull the marker out. Then you're going to put a pencil and holding everything together, continue spiraling as close as you can get one on top of the other and leave a little tail sticking up at the end. Okay, remove the pencil and you want to take that little part at the top and just fold it right down and straight up so you have a little loop and that is where your twine is going to go through. To attach the two parts of the acorn together, find the end of each spiral and you're going to twist those together just right at the ends just so that your acorn won't fall apart and then hide that in the middle of the acorn. Okay, now shape the cap to go over the top of your acorn and press everything together and there you go. To make the oak leaf, cross over the ends of the pipe cleaner about one inch and then twist those together to make a stem and to hold the pipe cleaner in place. At the top, we're going to make a rounded loop and then bend the ends into three loops going down the side. Now in an oak leaf, these are larger at the top than the bottom as opposed to a maple leaf where the edges get bigger. So we're going to bend three of slightly decreasing sides and they tend to want to get pointy. You want to keep those rounded if you can. So there's one side of our leaf. I'm going to turn it over and do the other. To put the garland together, leave a length of the twine at each end so that you have plenty to work with depending on where you're going to hang it. So start with a leaf and bend that stem in half tightly around the twine to keep it in place. And we're going to alternate leaves with acorns. So you can space these um, however you want. I like to go about three inches or so in between. So for the acorn, I'm going to open up that little top that I left and I'm going to go about three inches in and pinch that tightly to close the acorn on. Add another leaf. Okay. 
and continue on alternating acorns and leaves until the garland is as long as you would like it to be. Once the garland is as long as you'd like it to be, you can use it to decorate a mantle, a window, hang it on the wall, or maybe even a fall table. So have fun. Mm -hmm. 